Okay, can you all hear me? Happy Sunday as, okay, okay, great. Happy Sunday as Kim already mentioned. Um, welcome to Girl Genius. Thank you for spending your uh, Sunday evening with us. Won't be too long, but we appreciate it. This is our first uh, Girl Genius episode. episode. And it's a celebration and promotion of girl power. And we also want girls to feel like they can share their interests or talents around STEAM. So STEAM stands for Science, Technology, Engineering, Art, and Math. And so I'm Dr. Walmack. And then this is my daughter. Zora. Okay. Can you guys hear Zora? Yes. Yes. Okay. And Zora, tell them what you want to be when you grow up. Biochemist. Okay. You want to be a biochemist and biochemists are interested in chemistry, chemistry, mixing things, things of that nature. So you see, we have a display here of all these different chemicals. So we're going to get maybe a little messy. And can anyone guess? I mean, it might be hard to kind of guess, but what we might be mixing today. Okay, somebody said you need to need to speak up. Can anybody guess what we are uh, mixing here today? What our experiment is going to be about? And again, it might be kind of hard to to see. It's not what was featured online, but we just have a little packets, liquid soap, ketchup. Okay, so Mona said ketchup. Anybody else want to take a guess? It's not ketchup. Not ketchup. No guesses? Okay. All right. Well, we'll get started. We'll get into it. So as part of this, we have to put on our gloves. Oh, somebody said slime. Okay, good guess. Slime is a good guess. Um, and then mayonnaise. All right. So we have to put on our gloves and then our safety glasses, correct? And Zora will be leading the experiment here. We have the iPad over here and she'll be following the directions. So we have everything out already that needs to be taken care of. Okay. So you want to go ahead and get started? Oh, somebody said, Charlie said elephant toothpaste. That's interesting. Okay, elephant toothpaste. Not quite, Charlie, but we'll take you through and show you um, exactly what we're doing when we get to the part where, you know, you kind of see the last bits of this. All right? Okay, go ahead. You want me to say like what? Hmm? You want me to say like what we need? Mm. Yeah, you stuff? can. You can. Uh, we needed the conical flask. Conical. Conical flask. The safety glasses. Um, instead of this, we're using this one. So it's because it's gonna like be big. And then a uh, disposable cup right there. And the double-ended measuring spoon. The wooden stick, a uh, protective glove, and the syringe, 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 syringe to this thing. Okay, and we'll go to the next slide. We need the liquid soap, sodium carbonate. Um. Okay, so blue. she said. Okay, I'll oh, see. She already knows. She said the blue one, sodium carbonate. Uh. Antho, anthocyanin, yep. cyanin, and then the citric acid. Okay, so this is purple, and then the citric acid here. Okay, so, all right. So what's the first part of this? What does it say? What do the directions tell us to do? Pour one big spoon of anthocyanin into a plastic cup. All right, so where's the anthocyanin? These glasses don't fit me quite well. All right, go ahead. Wait a minute so they can see. All right, so the anthocyanin, I thought it was purple. What color is it? Brown or black. Brown or black, okay. 
This good? So one big spoon. I don't know. What do you think? Yeah. You think a little more? Okay. So she's pouring a little more in here. So show them. All right. And then pour it in the in the plastic cup. All right. Good. Okay. All right. What's the next? Uh, 20 millimeters. I mean, yeah, right? Yeah, 20 millimeters of water. water. Okay. So we're using the, what are we using? This syringe. Syringe. Okay. So here's the syringe. And we're going to put 20 milliliters of water in here. All right. So let's go. We do. Hmm? Oh, we got to keep it in. Okay. <laughs> She's the scientist. All right. Do it. All right, she knows more than mommy does. All right, so 20 milliliters. How many is that? 10. That's 10, okay. In here? Yeah. 10 in there. All right, and how many more do we need? We have 10 already. How many more do we need? Did Daddy say? Mona said nine. Close. Close. Ten. We need ten more. Because ten and ten is twenty. Good job, Kaziah. All right. So we have our twenty milliliters. All right. Next slide. Stir with the wooden stick. Okay. So we got to stir it. All right. So show the audience. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Good. Okay. All right. What's next? Uh, in the flask, the conical flask, we put one bottle of citric acid into it. Okay. So the full bottle of citric acid. I'll put this over here. Okay. And then, yeah, you can do it over there. All right. And tell them what color it is when you're pouring it in. What color is that? Okay. So this is white. I feel like this is like her shirt, kind of like burgundy. So like a purple burgundy-ish color. So this is the citric acid. And then what's the next thing? The whole bottle of um, sodium carbonate to the flask. Okay, so whole bottle of sodium carbonate. All right, so she's pouring that in. So this is also white as well. It's flaky. And it's and she said it's flaky. Okay. All right. And then swirl, swirl the flask to mix the reagents. Reagents. Okay. All right. So. So these two solids together. So some of you all that are taking, what are you taking? Physical science? Physical science, you might be familiar with solids and liquids, right? And gases. So we put the two solids together. And then what do we have to do? What does that say? Put it into the bowl. Set it in on the bowl. Okay. So we have the mixture in the bowl. And then we put the liquid soap. Okay. One add the one packet of liquid soap to the flask with the reaction mixture. Okay. So we're taking one packet of liquid soap. It was two. Yep. But it just said one, right? Yeah. One packet of liquid soap and then that's gonna go in the flask. Okay. So so somebody, so Kaziah said it's going to blow up. Okay, so we're hoping that um, it doesn't blow up <laughs> too badly. That's why we have this bowl here. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. But good guess that it's going to blow up. <laughs> and we'll tell you here in a second what, we, what we're doing. 
Okay, so this is the soap. If you're just tuning in, this is the soap that she's putting in here. And then do you remember the other two um, solids that we put in here? Sodium carbonate and citric acid. Okay, so sodium carbonate and citric acid. So we have three or two solids and then we're putting a liquid in here. Okay. And then what does it say now? Pour the solution into the, of the plastic cup into the flat. Okay. So somebody had already said that it's going to blow up. So would you, well, we'll wait, we'll wait and see if you know what it is. Okay. So here's the moment of truth. Hopefully it works. Okay, that was what it was. <laughs> so you see it here closer. All right. It looks kind of like slime. You want to touch it? Because it looks, yeah, looks kind of like slime. Okay. It has blue stuff. Yeah, it looks kind of freaky. So this was, what was this that happened? Can anybody guess before we tell you? What was it that happened? So it's like, what color? It's like gray, a gray purplish mixture. Okay, so Reason said it looks like elephant toothpaste. I don't even know what that is. You know what? Okay, I don't know what elephant toothpaste is. Um, Mona said a reaction. Yes, it's a reaction. So you want to tell them what it is? Yeah, it was a foam eruption. Okay, so it's called a foam eruption okay and then zora is going to read the um you don't want to read the what it consists of okay or how does it form because it tells you here um as you've already figured out the foam forms when a large amount of carbon dioxide gas bubbles vigorously um forms when they vigorously go through the liquid soap but how does the carbon dioxide form? So we initially mix the two substances. Do you all remember what the two were? What were the first two substances that we mixed? There were two, two uh, solids. Do you all remember? Even one of them? No? Okay. Here, I'll read it. Oh, somebody. Okay. Acid, very close. Citric acid and sodium carbonate. So as solids, they don't interact with each other. They react when we add water, or in this case, the water-based anthocyanin solution. Both citric acid and sodium carbonate split into eons in the water. And citric acid yields citric, citrate anions and hydrogen eons, while sodium carbonate yields carbonate anions and sodium cations. Lots of uh, heavy words here, okay? So all of this mixture together creates this foam eruption, okay? So that was just like a short little um, experiment here, but we wanted to showcase some of the things that Zora um, is interested in as um, a biochemist. And if you all are interested, I know that we also posted a video on um, our website where she did a sugar snake. And so just so you all know, it comes from this MEL chemistry set kit. You get a starter kit that you use with all of the different um, experiments that you do. So that's this here. And then every month they'll send you, I think two experiments that you get to do. So in this case, it was the sugar snake and the foam eruption. So that's what um, we did the foam eruption tonight. So that's what that one is. So if you're interested, again, it's called MEL um, chemistry set here. So um, 
coming up. If you all are interested in um, being on um, the Girl Genius episode and doing something similar like what we did here, of course, we wanted to be the first one so you can kind of see what it is Girl Genius is all about. And so if you wanted to um, be on here with your child or if you your grandchild or niece, um, just to showcase their interest in STEAM, you can uh, reach out to us and we can set up a date um, once a month where, <laughs> okay, so Kaziah's like, no, thank you. <laughs> LOL. It could be art. It's, it's science, technology, um, engineering, art, and math. So it doesn't have to be the science experiment because, again, she was the one kind of leading here because I didn't, I wouldn't have known what I was going to, what, what to do. So if, if it's anything around STEAM that your child may be interested in and you want to showcase here, um, contact us and we can have you on. Um, and you can be right in your living room, wherever, kitchen, and you can um, showcase your, your daughter's, uh, granddaughter's, niece, whomever, little cousin, their talents in STEAM. So yes, thank you all for tuning in. Um, again, we appreciate it. And um, if you came in a little bit late, again, this was the foam eruption experiment here. Okay, just to show it again. All right, so we appreciate it. And, um, you know, have fun the rest of your uh, Sunday night. Um, if there's no questions. Okay, Reason said, great job. Thank you. With, all right. <laughs> okay. Thank you guys.